Wow, I can actually feel how warm that is. Hello, little minions. It's me, Bo Jevisu. I am an EDC fanatic. And so I have been told, stay away from Olight. The, 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 the burst into flames in your pocket. And so me following along with, with, with the rest of the EDC crowd who I respect tremendously, and, I, and I've got such good advice from them until this moment, because I have been carrying an Olight, a Baton 2, this is the Baton 3, but I've been carrying the 2 for well over a year, using it multiple times a day. By the way, this is an unboxing of the Baton 3, in case you're wondering what in the world I'm doing as I'm blabbering on. And I'm just gonna say that this Baton 2 has served me through multiple countries, multiple times a day in industrial type situations, this one, of course, is super shiny. My other one, my baton too, it had paint chipping off of it. And some of you may say, see, see, it's cheap. Well, for some of you who might be able to afford a $150 flashlight, that's okay for you. For me, I'm actually looking for something slightly more expendable. Now, now this is still pretty pricey. Uh, let's say that it's, you know, I, I actually can't mention any prices because Amazon's gonna get mad at me because prices change and they'll take my video down. But let's just go ahead and open this up just to take a quick little look. Ah, that's why that little guy was not on there. And then it comes with the conventional rechargeable C123 uh, battery, CR123 battery, okay? And so this is always topped off every single evening because it comes with this little thing. And this is one of those features that I haven't found in a lot of other flashlights out there. So this goes onto there. So it's always charged every single day when you leave for work, it's charged because if in fact you keep this plugged into a USB, you just reach up on your nightstand, pull it off, put it in your pocket and out the door you go. So some flashlights, a few do have this, this magnetic feature, um, but uh, I, I've tried some and, and it just, it, it's, well, they're basically, they're huge flashlights. They're, they're like this tall. And this one is kind of this deep pocket type carry. And you'll see how deep this is. So barely anything is, is uh, actually peeking up right there. And yes, if I have a baseball cap on, it does immediately turn into a headlamp because that can clip on this way, or you can also clip it the other way. So it's kind of this S type uh, um, configuration. Does that make sense? So you can clip it this way or you can clip it that way. And then, uh, okay, so so uh, so that's one, and that's off. And so basically you could just tap it once and it starts up, or once you turn it on, you can hold it down, and that's brighter, and that's super bright. Wow, I can actually feel how warm that is. That's amazing. Uh, I'm not gonna shine it in your eyes. And then if we keep holding it down, it just goes back to low. Um, I prefer, probably around the medium function right there. So I have used Olight for well over a year and I've used and abused this thing here in the rainy Pacific Northwest and I don't know what's with all the hate. The proof is in the pudding. It works phenomenally for me. Is it a $150, $200 type flashlight that I'm gonna put on my gun and, and, and trust my life with? No, no it's not. But for my price point and some of the features that are, is built into this thing. The fact that it's so small and yet still super bright fits beautifully in my pocket right next to my my uh, my, my, my knife. It's, it works, it works beautifully. So I'm not gonna hate this at all because it served me well and I'm looking forward to the Baton 3 serving me even more with its extended battery life. So there's the unboxing right there. Uh, and it also comes with a, a little dinky felt thing. You don't care about that, do you? Uh, and then of course it also comes with a dinky little lanyard which I don't know why you would put a lanyard on this, but this is gonna be much better than any of my other flashlights that I've tested, and I've tested quite a few out there. And so for all you haters out there who, who, who dislike me because I am singing the accolades of Olight, it's worked for me. It may in fact work for you. It's bright, it's lightweight, love the features, five out of five stars, highly recommended.